Hello. Good day, peeps. My name is Scripps, and I am a pretty badass person. Don't laugh, yo. It's true. I love horror movies. I love horror games. They're some of my favorite genres when it comes to any sort of media. I love anything that's remotely scary, spooky, even disturbing at times. And I'm one of the Gen Zers who've been living on the internet for so long that I think I've gotten pretty much immune to anything that the internet can throw at me. But the last video that I did, where it was sort of this vloggy reacting to stuff type of video, um, I disproved that theory completely. My reputation feels like a Greek tragedy. People used to come to me, asking me for like suggestions for the scariest horror movies or the scariest games or like the, the creepiest, most disturbing videos I could find, and I would show them. I would show them and, and they'd be, be bewildered. But today, I'm, I'm just nothing but a shadow of my former self, really. I watched Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, a Quentin Tarantino movie with my mom and my sister, and during the violent part I was the only one who cringed up and almost like covered my eyes like a little, little wuss. I've been taking my driver's license and during one of my driver's ed classes, there was this video with a car that rammed into a rubber doll, and I was the only one who went, ooh. And then everyone was laughing at me. They said they'd love to watch horror movies with someone as inexperienced and wussy as me. Do you know the pain? But today is the day that that ends. We're not gonna watch a few videos about anxiety on Reddit somewhere. We're gonna crank it up to 13 and we're gonna watch the internet's most infamous videos. And you guys are gonna see my pure, unfiltered, First time reaction. Actually, it's not my first time reaction. For for a lot of these, uh, it might not be my first time reaction at all because I've, I've I've heard of a lot of them and I've clicked on them like out of curiosity. But I think most of those I watched when I was like fourteen. Oh God, let's do this. My only real question is if these videos even exist like anymore. Most infamous videos on the internet. I know some of them, but I'm gonna need the internet's help to find uh, like a bunch of other ones. What is the most violently disturbing video? Oh. What? Head over to a website called runthegauntlet.org and find out how far you can watch. The succeeding video will not be loaded until you watch the current video in its entirety. You can always cheat, play the current video, and then momentarily leave and come back. Runthegauntlet.org? What is runthegauntlet.org? I'm terrified. Oh god, there's porn ads. The most vile, puke inducing, hard to watch videos on the internet. This site is not safe for work and contains adult related content. You must be of eagle age to continue. By the way, I want to say right off the bat, you won't see any of this. It'll be censored, all of it. It'll be all censored. Don't worry, you don't need to be worried about your own safety. Be worried about my safety for once. I'm 19, soon to be 20. There's there's no no, no dear mom where I'm going. All right, begin your journey. This wasn't actually what I planned. Arm break after two chicks arm wrestle. I got her, I got her. You got a good hand on that? Okay, lost the one and go! ISS Houston, stand by. We may have a problem here. What? Oh! That's not that bad. Oh my god. I think she broke her forearm. Yeah, it's basically just two girls arm wrestling. Uh, yeah. One of them broke the forearm. That's not that bad. Next level. Jackass paper cuts. No. I, can't, I could never watch Jackass. I'm getting paper cuts between the webbings of my fingers and the webbings of my toes. <laughs> I'm gonna look so- See, the thing is, Jackass is famous. Oh, you can feel when it goes it, well, it's famous or infamous, and there's so many people who've watched it. So people who watch this without the censor know how much of a wuss I am at this point. That wasn't that bad. You couldn't see much. <sighs> Russian Roulette Knife Cup Test Challenge- No, no! Show him before messing up hand and knifing his hand. All right, so this is the uh, Russian roulette routine I was telling you about uh, called Stigmata. What it is is it uses a knife, four styrofoam cups, and a turntable. The knife goes in the turntable where it can spin around. Oh, you fucking idiot. And then I spin it fast enough that nobody can see where it goes. Oh, in a live performance, I might uh, obstruct the view of the audience for just a bit so that me, neither me nor the uh, audience knows where the knife is. And then I make my psychic selection, 
And if all goes well... Ah! Oh! Oh! You fucking idiot! Ta-da! <laughs>video continued bad english when i excuse my thank you <sighs> i'm like sweating and i i don't know I, it doesn't seem like you can see it on camera it it doesn't and it's crazy but i'm like crazy sweaty right now and i i know look you've probably seen people react to this video before and you're like they didn't take it that bad all I'm saying is, I'm not sitting here freaking dry heaving and just absolutely... I'm not sitting here doing this just so you guys can sit there and tell me that, oh, my reaction's fake. Screw you! That's the closest I've been to, like... I don't know. Like, th that's the weirdest thing. I've never been stimulated visually into, like, being... 
I mean, I, the last people I saw do this was like Markiplier and Ethan when they did it on their Unis Honest. None of them even heaved. None of them even... I mean, I watched the whole thing, thank God, but... <clears throat> don't do the Run the Gauntlet, by the way. Don't do it. I don't want to spark an internet challenge where people watch that. I don't want to. I mean, if it was just gross stuff, that would be fine. But it's also, like, um, all kinds of really, 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 really horrible stuff with, like, people getting hit by trains and stuff. It's it's literally the worst of the worst you can find on the internet, I think. Should we go one more? I can't wait <laughs> to games like, uh, I don't know, Ori and the Will of the Wisps or something comes out uh, where I can just like have that running on my channel for a while and I don't have to come up with weird stuff like this. I mean, it's not original, not by a long shot. People did this back in 2000 freaking 9 or something. But I mean, I personally find people's reactions entertaining, although I think mine has been the most um, un not on purpose, exaggerated, like just horrible reaction. Like, I don't even know if those were all the worst videos. There's, I know there's like Pain Olympics, Meat Spin, like Meat Spins, that's easy go, man. Meat Spin, that's like something I'd watch on like a Saturday evening if I had nothing else to do. But there's also like Finger Paint, just a lot, a lot, of, a lot, a lot of like... <laughs> a lot of poop stuff. I mean, I get it, butt stuff. Butt stuff I get, butt stuff's fun. Butt stuff's fun, and for like, I don't know. It's just, uh, it's just innocent fun, and for a lot of people, that's their only, like, type of fun. When it comes to that kind of fun. And I get that, but the poop, the, the consumption of... Poop? The consumption of very few things, like, actually, human-related is something I am, uh... Yeah, uh, that's a hard no for me. But anyways, leave a comment down below whether you want me to go further down this gauntlet. Not necessarily run the gauntlet.org, but just go further down the list of... <sighs> because I still don't feel like I really completed my ritual of becoming a true internet dweller who can survive pretty much anything that's on here. I feel like I just got introduced to, like, the new frontier. I felt like I was a cocky bastard, and I went up to this and I just got my absolute ass whooped. But anyways, peeps, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.